Okay. You know, um, my view is that most large organizations, when they build customer support, they are imposing their org chart on their end customers, right? And so over the last few decades, um, you know, folks have, have introduced a whole bunch of self-service options for their customers. And these are very piecemeal, right? So this department has an FAQ page on their subsite, and this, you know, uh, this department does, you know, social media-based support and responds here. And there's this number you can call to talk to this department, um, and you have to navigate this this horrendous maze, right? And there was a, a webinar I was watching some of your previous webinars, right? And there was uh, there was an interview with a conversation designer. I can't remember her name, I'm afraid, or the company she worked for, but she brought this wonderful example, right, where they they had these you know two sets of functionality that the chatbot was developing and one was around i think it was like one was around savings and one was around loans and so you know the first question they would ask is hey are you are you getting in touch with us about savings or loans and people would respond yes <laughs> right and it's just such a beautiful example of saying here's my view of the world here's the way that i buckets of things we have savings customers and we have loans customers and please identify yourself as such. Um, but that's not how, how, how you know, people think about uh, the world, right? That's, that's just how you inside of an organization um, think and, and organize things. And that I think is fundamentally the reason behind all of this.